<laughs> there we go proper intro again all right we're gonna keep it going i got two boxes right here went to target the other day pick these up these are the marvel studios allure by upper deck they're um pretty pricey in the uh, uh hobby box version i think it's like 350 bucks and so uh i mean i love allure hockey so, you know, it was like, might as well, you get a blaster box exclusive, collect the yellow taxi base parallel. So that's kind of what we're going to get one of those, which sounds pretty cool. Um, what other things can we get? Collect the blaster box exclusive base parallel, four cards per pack, five packs per box of so 20 cards. So buck a card on these guys. Um, I don't see anything else special, a whole bunch of, you know, little micro font telling you what you know else you can get i am not going to sit there and try to figure out what that is i uh if you just i haven't posted yet but i will post a video i just opened some monopoly prism basketball got a number one out of 500 luka Doncic, the gold shimmer pretty dope card pretty happy with that let's adjust the camera here hey it's good enough, right? I think we're pretty level. All right, so what was that? Four cards per pack, five packs, something like that. Get a little, I don't know how, how easy these are. All right, so let's see here. First guy, we got the Falcon. There is our, uh, it's not a bad gold taxi shimmer, whatever the heck. The heck do they call this again? I will take Thor all day long on a, oh my gosh go in your sleeve there we go so there we go from the infinity saga chris hemworth as thorm that's the yellow taxi these got a curve to them so we're going to need 60 point top loaders for this pile set those right there there we go they'll fit in a nice 60 point no problems there so we got thor First pack out of the gate. All right, we got Black Panther. And we got Vision. Okay, can we actually pop these? How easy? Oh my gosh, nope. Upper deck packs. Notoriously, pain in the ass is to open, which is a good thing. I mean, I'd rather it be hard to open. All right, we got... Obadiah Stane. Oh, we got Mr. Happy Hogan from Iron Man 3. And that is the orange slice. So we got an orange slice of Happy Hogan. Mr. John Favreau himself. Not numbered or anything. Hemsworth, not numbered. Let's see what else we got. We got Proxima Midnight and we got Spider-Man. And it looked like Midnight. That's like a blue one. Yeah, that's like blue. It doesn't say anything on it, but definitely a different one there. Proxima Midnight. Is that him, her, her? Right, Proxima Woman. Off to the side there. Peggy Carter, Thor Ragnarok, Gamora. And that is a yellow taxi Gamora. So we got Thor and Gamora. I thought I would only just get like one. I didn't know I'd get more than one taxi. And we got Civil War Spider-Man. All right, we got Rocket Raccoon, Captain America, and we got Goose the Cat. Goose the Cat. Okay. Yellow Taxi on Goose. These are pretty cool cards, though. I think they were, I don't know, 25 bucks or something. 20 bucks, so actually a little more. There's 20 cards per box, so a little more than a dollar a piece. Um... Still, I'll take it. 
Target and all those guys have all, definitely, you know, that's one thing I tell people in the shop. Let's just go ahead and pre-slice these. I tell people in the shop all the time, like, blaster boxes used to kind of be poop. And, uh, but they used to only be like, I remember back in the day, Walmart would always have some weird price, like 1888 or something on like better ones. You know, you could get series one of, 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 you know, MLB, the NHL ones, they'd all be in that like 13 to $16 range or something. And once everybody kind of went crazy during card boom and started snagging them all up. All right. We got a Groot. We got Groot and Groot, but this is going to be the Black Rainbow Groot. So they, they're mixing these up just like they do on the hockey. But what I was saying is, so they used to, you know, be kind of poop. And after the card boom, they started making them more money and more money and more expensive and all that stuff. Oh, wait, we got a Black and we got Jane Foster, Natalie Portman, who is the love of my life. Sorry, my, my wife. Natalie Portman shows up on the front porch, says, Ryan, I've heard your sultry voice on the YouTubes, and I just, I can't live my life without you. I think my wife would understand. I'd, I'd ask her if she uh, knows John Hamm, though. I'd try to at least set that up for my wife. Or maybe even Thor. I'd be like, hey, let's go Avengers style or something here. Spider-Man. We got the Winter Soldier. I like him. Winter Soldier, and that's going to be the Red Prism. Get a lot of variety in these things. This is kind. Of, these are kind of cool. Uh, man, now I'm kind of double thinking that 350 bucks for the thing. We got a yellow taxi of Hawkeye. Right, that's our yellow taxi. Yeah, Hawkeye, yellow taxi. Now I'm not going to be selling any of these die. These these refractors or anything unless uh let's stick proxima over there proxima's that's monique ganderton as proxima midnight from avengers infinity war all right um proxima will get sold i don't care about keeping proxima yo vin diesel as groot what is this Character posters. A Groot character poster card. That's interesting. Not as cool as like the yellow taxis or anything. And then we got Nick Fury in one of those blue refractor guys. They they kind of they definitely load these up. I you know I I, I nobody ever opened any of these in the shop. I never watched a break or anything on them which i should but i personally think that they should just give all the employees one free box and uh let us open them or maybe just let us open them in the shop there we go we got loki in the yellow taxi yellow taxi loki i'll take that definitely need 60 points 55 60 points when you're opening these guys though because they're all the got the curve to them and there's Loki again. Cool base cards. Base cards will just drop right into my quarter bin. The Wasp. Ant-Man. We got Howard Stark. John Slattery as Howard Stark. But I don't, I don't think I'll convince them that they should give us a free box. Especially, I can picture them saying, like, you can have one pack or something. And then you have to open it and give it away or something. Alright, we got the Wasp in the Black Rainbow. And, oh, we got two more inserts in that same pack. So only one base card in that pack. Whoop. Like I said, I bought these at Target. So we got a poster of... Uh, Nebula. Nebula poster. It's pretty cool. And then we got the blue of War Machine. Big print line on there, though. Look right there. Don Cheadle as 
War Machine big old print line right across the bottom. But the other ones all looked pretty good. I didn't see anything that jumped right out at me. Now sometimes you have to really stare at them. All right, so pile of base cards. War Machine. We got a poster of Nebula. We got Howard Stark. We got Nick Fury. We got another poster of Groot. And we got the uh, uh, Proxima Midnight Blue. And then these ones. We got a black, the black rainbow of the Wasp. We got the yellow taxi of Loki. We got a yellow taxi of Hawkeye. We got the red prism of Winter Soldier. We got a yellow taxi of Natalie Portman, Jane Foster there. We got the black, uh, uh, what are these again? Black Rainbow of Groot. <laughs> we got Goose. We got Gamora. Yellow Taxi, Yellow Taxi. Thor, Yellow Taxi. And then we got an orange slice of Happy Hogan, John Favreau. So, hey, I'd give the Marvel Studios Allure trading cards from uh, Upper Deck a thumbs up big time. Those are pretty cool cards. Like I said, I picked up the two boxes at... At Target, probably was 50 bucks for the two boxes, something like that. These are pretty cool. Definitely get yourself some 60-point top loaders for to hold these guys down. And it looks like you're going to need some because, I mean, this is two boxes worth. These are all our inserts. So pretty cool stuff. Um, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, share, all that fun stuff like that. But...